Yeah. All right, these are the Oceanside Store glass tanks. Um, up here you can see some of our larger cages that we house albino Burmese pythons in. We've got them for sale right now for $159 online. Um, down here we have some green tree pythons, baby water dragons, waxy monkey tree frogs, various geckos and some more boas. Over here we have a bunch more cages with our medulla lizards, day geckos, for geckos down in here. And pictus geckos in there, some baby lichianus geckos in this cage, you can see them right up front. Hamhara geckos, flat rock lizards, red footed tortoises, baby frilled dragon, uh, ornate uromastics, baby beardids, ornate uromastics. Over here is a baby molly uromastics, green basilisks right up front. Agamas, Rankin's dragons, we've got a little baby. Uh, diamond cross jungle carpet pythons. Tons and tons of hermit crabs. We've got jumbo, large, small, and painted. Uh, green lacerda, you can see it right up front there. Uh, flying geckos, there's one in the back. Crested geckos, crested geckos. Fire belly toads. Uh, these are really good starter frogs for anyone looking for a good first time pet. Um, a medium islandy lichianus gecko, real pretty. More lychees, baby crested. There's a pretty one right up front. And then over here we have small black and white mangrove snakes, uh, baby centralium pythons, Arian Jaya carpet pythons. Um, here is more coastal carpet. Baby Colombian rainbow boas. These guys love burrowing. You can actually see one peeking out right there. Um, coastal jaguar carpet pythons in that cage hiding. Some more hermit crabs. <laughs> These ones are painted shells. Um, baby gargoyle geckos. You can see one in the back. Uh, velvet geckos. These are sakalavas. Uh, you can kind of see it hiding under the cork there. Um, some adult female coaches, giant day geckos. Uh, these guys are the ones you'll see on our Facebook page making the silly faces all the time. They're pretty cool. Um, and here are some marbled geckos. Down here are some striped gargoyle geckos, house geckos, giant black millipedes. These are super hard to get right now. Uh, up here are some baby coastal carpet pythons, uh, small female yellow green tree pythons, um, more green tree pythons. Baby tomato frogs, these guys always burrow, so they're kind of hard to see in the cage. Uh, Madagascar giant day geckos with regrown tails, there's one at the top. Uh, baby red-eyed tree frogs, more baby red-eyed tree frogs, you can see a bunch of them on the wall right there. An adult male tinctorious arrow frog, he was hiding. Uh, more giant day geckos, uh, baby Indonesian tree frogs. Adult male crested gecko, you can see him right there. Um, African clown tree frogs, these guys also hide pretty cool, pretty well, but they're pretty neat if you want some frogs for an African cage. Adult tomato frogs, also buried. Bumblebee toes, you can actually kind of, if you look real close, right there, you can see one hiding. Ooh, covered him right there. Uh, New Guinea legless lizards are in here. These guys are actually exclusively lizard eaters and are actually closely related to geckos. They have to lick their eyes to keep them moist. Some more day geckos in here. And that is most of the glass tanks here in the Oceanside store. It's pretty cool. Hi Lauren. Oh, come on. All right, so these are the Oceanside store vision cages. The Oceanside store is actually the, one of the few stores that has vision cages stacked up taller than most people can reach. We have a ladder that we use to get into them. Up here we have Colombian boas. There are some Euromastics in this cage, mollies. More mollies, these ones are just a bit bigger so we didn't want to mix them with the other ones. Nigerian Euromastics, um, adult male ball pythons. Uh, some water monitors, red-headed agamas. These guys are pretty awesome. We've got, you can see one male in the back and a bunch of his ladies. A bunch of Irian Jaya blue-tongued skinks. These ones are real pretty ones. You can see them there. 
Uh, empty cage sold today and it's some adult hog island boas, sub-adult ball pythons in there. Um, savannah monitors also sold. Down here you can see some more savannas. We just got a group of them in. Um, adult okatees, these guys, or corn snakes, sorry, these guys are all hiding in different places, such as right there. Down here, an adult red-footed tortoise. Uh, over here is a large Maruk amethystine python. You can see him in the back here. Here are some of our adult Colombian boas. These are the huge ones that you've seen us posting online lately. Uh, these are doing super, super well. This is an adult female Centralian python. She looks like she's actually trying to get ready to shed right now. Um, she is super sweet and mellow. Real nice snake. Um, there's some king snakes up there. Some adult male bearded dragon. Mangrove monitor. Suriname red tails. That one's peeking out. More bearded dragons. Sailfin dragons. Uh, Spex hingeback tortoise. Uh, move our ladder here. You can see Curtis checking on some Euromastics over there. Down here is a California king snake, empty cage, another adult bearded dragon, Peruvian long tail probe crammed in the back there in his cave. There is a perfect example of why you don't necessarily need to give an animal the largest hide possible, just give it one that it can fit into. It'll It'll make it work. Uh, here's another Maruk amethystine. This one's a little bit smaller. Still real pretty. Uh, a medium female Sonoran boa. Some small black roughneck monitors up there in that cage. Um, Emperor scorpions. Baby Argus monitors. And a mouse room to eat. Adult male jeweled lacertas hiding in the back. Baby Colombian cross Argentine boa. These guys are cool with some cool pattern. Baby Italian or small Italian leatherback bearded dragons. Baby yellow monitors. African fat tail geckos. Adult, another adult bearded dragon. We have to keep all the males separate just so that they don't fight. It's easiest on them um, and so people can pick the exact animal they want. There's Domino, the store dog. <laughs> uh, Sub-adult coastal cross jungle carpet python. Real, real pretty snake. Um, and another adult male bearded dragon. <laughs> a large Dumeril's monitor. More Dumeril's monitors. Oh, it came in cross Cuban rock iguana. Is that to visit? Red eyed croc skinks in here. Somewhere. Green red tailed rat snake. This one's actually a really cool one that we have right now. He's kind of reddish colored. Uh, another adult male bearded dragon. Like I said, they all get housed separately. A uh, medium Aryan Jaya carpet python. You must be hiding. <laughs> An adult female Savu python. She's actually wrapped all the way around the border. Sub adult bearded dragon with a nip tail. Medium hypo Nicaraguan bow in there. Some white lined geckos. You can see it hiding. Uh, Toke geckos. You can see a tail. Male colored Amazon tree boa. Somewhere. Adult blood red corn snakes in that cage. Adult root beer. <laughs> root beer corn snakes. More corn snakes. White spotted geckos. He was following me. These guys are actually really funny looking, but I can't see any right now. Small Argus monitor. You can see him back there. Another male bearded dragon. Uh, flame belly girdle tail lizards. These guys are super, super neat. Once you get them established, the males will get uh, jet black on top and neon orange on their knee. There's an Arizona mountain king snake. You can see it there. Black tree monitor. So that one's sleeping down there. Yellow monitor. You can see her <laughs> looking out at me. She's super sweet. Uh, Subital Amazon gray tree bows. You can actually see one under there sleeping. There might be some more, yeah, back in the corner. Uh, Sub-adult male green tree monitor, which is hanging out right there. Some pancake tortoises in that cage. Sub-adult yellow foot tortoises. Empty cage. Uh, these are baby iguanas. These are the Suriname green ones that we have right now. These ones tend to have some of the best color. They tend to stay the greenest. 
Got some big carpet pythons in here, sub-adult males. Uh, and then down here, bunches and bunches of Indonesian white tree frogs. Lots and lots of them, that's why they get such a big cage. And there you have it, that's the Oceanside Vision Cages. Lots and lots of them. There you go.